The saying goes, blondes have more fun. Marilyn, Grace, Debbie, Farrah, Madonna, Gwen. These are all iconic blondes in pop culture that have had some sort of impact. So are we about to add a pair of dumb blondes to that list? Now I know what you're all thinking. Who is Dumb Blonde? Dumb Blonde is made up of Aubrey O'Day and Shannon Bex. They rose from the ashes of the failed Danny Kane reunion to create a one-of-a-kind dance pop duo that brings an exciting breath of fresh air to pop music. Dumb Blonde's self-titled debut album is out right now. It's an album that features complex production and abstract lyrics about love, loss, strength, and chasing your dreams. The record contains 11 songs, all having their own distinct sound that reference a certain time in dance music. From 80s pop to trance to 90s to pure electronic to trap, there's so many different styles that can be found on Dumb Blonde. And really, Aubrey and Shannon have their team of collaborators to thank for that. Without the helps of radio, Candace Play, or Dem Joints, this record would not have been the same and Aubrey and Shannon would not have been able to create such a solid body of work. So what are some standouts from the record? My favorite changes day to day, but to help you guys get into this record a little bit, I'm gonna highlight a few tracks for you. Now, if you're looking for the most different sound, you guys should check out Tender Green Life. It's got this funky bass line throughout. It reminds me of something from Prince or Michael Jackson's discography. It's completely different from anything they've ever done. It's sung in a falsetto. It's got this very trippy ambient vibe. So if you're looking to get into something totally, totally different, that's one that should be on your radar. However, if you're a pop head and you're not looking for something so abstract, I suggest for you to get into the house-driven You Got Me, the Caribbean flared Remember Me, or the 80s pop anthem Dreamsicle. Now, if you like a little bit of substance and emotion to your music, I suggest listening to Take Away and Carry On. Both songs deal with picking up the pieces from failure and saying goodbye to the past and looking forward to the future. Now, if you thought these girls were busy just working on music, you're wrong. Aubrey and Shannon have been able to shoot a music video for nearly every single track off their debut album. What's great about their videos is that we all step into a certain world and a certain part of their artistry that we didn't even get to see in other projects. Whether it's the stormy white lightning, the pop art dream sickle, the trippy surreal tender green life, or the bewitching carry on, there's always a different element that you can look forward to every single time Dumblon releases a music video. Speaking of Dumblon releasing a music video, they've released four so far and there's three to four more left. Amongst those three to four more left are Remember Me and Waiting On You. Remember Me is supposed to have this whole beachy vibe that really complements the production on the record and Waiting On You was filmed in stop time. Sadly, there will be no music video for Love Blind as of right now, but fingers crossed that that remaining visual is for You Got Me. Not only have these girls been on their grind working on an album and music videos for their album, they've also been working tirelessly to perfect a stage show that they've been previewing all across the country. During their stage show, they're really bringing their music videos to life. There's a lot of quirky elements to their stage show. There's a lot of drama. There's dance sequences that these girls are known for. They've had a few one-off dates and they just wrapped up their first East Coast tour. More dates are to be announced soon for Dumb Blonde, but if you can't wait until then, I suggest you heading over to popologynow.com and watch their debut performance of White Lightning on Good Day New York. It previews their stage show a little bit and you guys can brace yourself to what's gonna come to a city near you very, very soon. Woo, so is that a commercial or what? Honestly, I love this project. I love these girls. They have been very supportive of Popology Now and I've been very supportive of them. Please check out their record. It is filled with a lot of great music. It does take a little bit to get into, but as soon as you tune into what their product is, I'm sure that you guys will love it. I mentioned several songs that you guys can get into. I really recommend the poppier songs for you guys to ease into Dumblon before listening to a lot of their other music. I know I talk a good game when it comes to a lot of pop music, but there's no reason why anyone shouldn't be listening to this record, talking about this record, sharing this record, and buying this record. If you like their record, let me know in the comments below. I wanna know what your favorite songs are. I can talk about Dumb Blonde all day. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you wanna see more from this channel, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.